All right, welcome back to the channel. Max Torno here. I'm in Helsinki, a little bit of a shopping tour. And in this video, I want to talk about how I would get started from scratch if I had no brand, no channel, no reputation, no advertisement whatsoever. So if you like the idea of, you know, building your own freedom business from scratch, you don't have a brand yet. You know, you think you need a big brand or anything. Or maybe you feel a little confused. You don't know how you get started. I'm going to tell you exactly how I would get started. I'm also going to tell you exactly how I got started from zero and what type of systemization we're helping our clients with for them to get started with their own online coaching or online service providing businesses literally from scratch. So if you like the idea of you know, making money, if you like the idea of being free, if you like the idea of getting started, this video is for you. Let's get started. Have you ever wondered whether there's more to life than a boring dead-end 9 to 5 job? Have you ever dreamed about breaking free, you know, traveling the world, making good money and just enjoying life? No more office dress code, no morning commute, no boss. This channel is for you. So here's to your freedom. All right, so let's assume you want to build your own business from scratch. You're a complete nobody. You might not even be aware of what exact skill that you could be offering to people. What would be the first step to get started? Well, the first step would actually be understanding what you're good at, understanding what the value is that you could be offering other people, right? You can have us analyze your strengths, for example. This is uh, what many of our clients have done. They booked a call with us. They had us analyze their strengths and then they kind of knew, okay, this is the type of offer that I could create. Uh, so that's kind of the focus on you. And then you basically go ahead to step two and say, okay, what's the focus on the people that could potentially be my clients? And what you want to do there is you want to understand what exactly is it that you could potentially be helping them with and uh, what are the issues, the problems that go along with that, all right? So let's say, for example, you're someone who's relatively good at fitness, right? Maybe you've you've overcome that challenge yourself, you've become fitter, right? Or maybe you've you found your dream partner, you've overcome that challenge yourself, or maybe you have some skill from, from some of you, from one of your jobs that uh, you say, okay, that's actually good to start my own business with. And what you then do is like, okay, who are the people that I could help with? What problems are they having in that regard? What have they tried before maybe? Or, uh, you know, what are their goals? What are their dreams about that? And so on and so forth. What are sort of misconceptions about that? Just like I'm, for example, helping you with the misconceptions of creating your own online business. And what you then want to do is you want to find out where are these people online, right? Where are the online gathering places of these people? Because obviously you want to have an online business, right? You don't want to be depending on, on offline, especially in nowadays times with, with quarantine and whatnot. So you basically find out where these people are hanging out online. And here's where the entire idea of not needing a brand comes in. That's the beautiful thing because most people think like, oh my God, I need to have a brand. I need to have a YouTube channel so people come to me. That's not at all what you need to do. You need to be able to come to people, right? That's what we call direct outreach or manual lead generation. That is literally what I've done in the very, very beginning, way before you might've known me from any of my channels, maybe even way before you might've known me from my very first channel, from my very first business. Direct outreach is you find out where these people are hanging out online. Could be Facebook groups, could be uh, LinkedIn. LinkedIn is something that a lot of our clients are using to get their first 10K, 20K worth of clients. and. Uh, then you just literally have to reach out to these people. And uh, obviously what we're doing with our beginner clients is um, uh, we give them a script, a DM script. We tell them exactly what they can write in order to make people excited about jumping on a call with you. On the call, you give them some value. You get to know their situation a little bit better. And then you literally make them excited about working together with you. And then boom, you have your first client. And even if you feel like, okay, I'm not sure if I'm, if I'm, uh, if I'm good enough, I'm not sure if I am confident enough to, to already charge money. Well, you get your first test client for free for half the price, what so on and so forth. That's a very, very simple way and also the most direct way. And it's also a way that is easily replicable. And you know, that's exactly the way that and I've started to make my very first four figures uh, way before I had a YouTube channel, way before I worked together with other people or my mentors way back in the days. It's, it's the most direct way. It doesn't cost you any money. It costs you a little bit of time and it costs you a little bit of trial and error until you kind of find out what exactly it is that works best for your specific audience and your specific offer. And yeah, that way you get the quote unquote foot in the door. And what you do then is after that, you can start building a brand on top of that. All right, we literally just found this random, beautiful bar type restaurant thing. They have pumpkin cocktails. They have pumpkin cocktails. <laughs> I'm gonna get a pumpkin cocktail. <laughs> it. 
It actually sounds fantastic. But before we're going to get into the next part, if you haven't done so yet, check out our podcast. I'm going to link it down in the description below as well. My business partner, Nikita Gunkiewicz, and me, we have a podcast where we talk a little bit deeper about the, the process of building a business, the mindset, the mindset mistakes that behind that that a lot of people have. We'll get a little bit deeper into that. If you feel like the YouTube videos are a little bit too surface level, the podcast goes a lot deeper into that. So I highly recommend you checking it out. People say it's very, very informative and also very entertaining. Obviously, Nikita and I, we obviously sometimes go on, on quite the ranty uh, <laughs> parts there so i strongly recommend you check it out there's a link down in the description below and uh, yeah i'll see you there i don't know what this is but it's vegetarian it's really good and she got a vegan burger that's right gg okay so on top of that solid business foundation where you're already making your 10 20k a month then you build a brand on top of that because by that time you know that what you have to offer sells right by that time also you know that what you have to offer actually helps people so you have a proof of concept that's what it's called. And then from there, you can build a very lucrative brand. And even with that, you don't just want to build a random brand that is, you know, uh, viral content that is just living off clicks and engagement or anything like that. You want to build a brand that attracts the right people, people that want to take action, people that want to learn from you, people that are actually willing uh, to improve and not just random, you know, fanboys or people that just like and, you know, live vicariously through you. And um, that being said, you can that way create a brand that is very lucrative and that is more on, focused on quality instead of quantity. And that's also what we're doing with our advanced clients. Uh, brand building is something that I'm personally very, very passionate about. But other than that, it's, it's, it's not even a necessity at that point. It's just a multiplying factor, almost like a leveraging factor. And then obviously you can uh, start implementing Facebook ads or any other sort of paid advertising. And then you can you make your first key hires. You start delegating some of the things. That's what our advanced clients are doing. And then you know they have a, a, a real business going. And that's really, really beautiful. And then at that point, you can choose what route you want to go down. Do you want to just you know stay at the, the one man mission, the one man army type of thing, making your 20, 30K a month? Or do you want to build a team and be surrounded by A players and get more in a management role where you then just kind of like build a business that runs automatically. You're just there to manage, just to lend your face to the business. And you know, that was something that, a choice that I've made many, many years ago very, with my very first business. I started doing info products and they were cool, they were okay. And they, they, they got a lot of people great results, but then I kind of figured out, hey, I could just take all that money and, and, and keep it for myself or I create a, a different type of program, a different kind of product that is not only the information, but also the support, the real feedback. And uh, what I did is then I started hiring uh, an A player team. I surrounded myself with experts that would, uh, would help me teach my clients belong, uh, uh, alongside me. And that was then a very beautiful thing because okay, maybe I'm making a little less profit, but at the end of the day, I can really cause an impact. I could really have a, have a positive influence on the people that buy from me. And of course, also I get inspired by that team because it's not just me, this one man operation, but I'm actually having something of, of, of value, something that, that grows, something that inspires each other. And I'm part of this kind of like upward spiral. And that is how I would do it if I would start from scratch again. So kind of to summarize, no, you do not need to have a big brand. And, you do not need to have a good reputation or anything. You can literally get started with a very, very lean business model that allows you to make your 10, 20K a month first. And then on top of that, you would deploy the power of social media and brand building as a leveraging multiplying factor. And then you can also do paid advertising and you just scale that up. And again, you can then have the choice to to stay like that, being a one man mission, one man army, or one woman army in that, in, that, in that regard. Or you decide to go down the team route where you're kind of building a bigger operation, something that that is bigger than you, you know, it's something that grows beyond you, which is what I went down and which is what uh, many of our very advanced clients are doing. And that's a very, very beautiful thing to be in. And it's also not too difficult either because a lot of people think, oh, they have to have a lot of responsibility at that point. But ultimately, it's just very, very simple. And if you do it right, it's a very, very wonderful, beautiful thing to do. So if that excites you, if you say this sounds great, that you can tap that link down in the description below. I'm going to put a link there. Uh, that link brings it to a page where you can book a free consulting call with us. You'll be talking a real person, not an automated bot funnel or anything like that. And on that call, we can help you get started with your own freedom business, whether you are completely at the start 
you feel a little lost, you feel a little confused, you don't know what it is that you could be doing, or whether you're already making some money and you want to scale it up, we can help you. So there's a link down in the description, breaks into a page, you can read some more information on that page, and then at the bottom of that page, you fill out the application, it takes you maybe two minutes to fill it out, and then you can book the exact date and time where you want us to call you. Like I said, call is entirely for free, but you do have to fill out that application. And then, yeah, maybe with a little bit of luck, we can work together. I'll be very excited about that. And yeah, thank you very much for watching. I appreciate that. Talk soon. Bye bye. What's up, FBM? So today I just want to share something with you. Uh, I closed my third client a few days ago for 1.5K. Yep. And uh, so in total, uh, since joining FBM, I closed for 4K. Um, before joining FBM, I didn't know how to, to close, how to sell. But now, thanks to this program, I can do it uh, by my own. And uh, it was my dream to become my own boss. And now I can do it alone so yeah i feel uh, amazing about this and uh, yeah it's just the beginning and uh, now i want to push more to get more money yep that's it and uh, gg